Thank you for tuning in to another episode of Classified Captures. Thrills, excitement, and jump scares are all I promise for you today. Without wasting too much of your precious time, let's jump right into it. Take a look at this picture. Can you see a shirtless elderly man? Hairy, but not the Bigfoot kind, with facial hair and an expression that looks pretty aggressive to me. There are stories of wild humans, yes, you heard me, humans that are feral and untouched by civilization. They're said to be living in the woods and once in a while are spotted. These people are known to have an animalistic instinct that can make them dangerous. Given the way they are, they don't care to take a bath, which has them looking so dirty with a smell that could make your head ache. Looking at this picture right here, I'm tempted to think that this being is one of those feral humans. I mean, he looks like a wild man, unless there's more to the photo I'm not seeing. What do you think? Now here's a clip that might give you the chills, a suspected dogman sighting. So the eyewitness catches this strange creature in the act, digging away in a cemetery. At first he's thinking, okay, maybe it's just a person doing some grave digging. But hold on, the features of this digger don't quite add up to your typical human. The upper torso is almost human-like, but there's a bit more bulk and hairiness going on. And when it lifts its head, bam, we're looking at what seems like the silhouette of a dogman. What in the world is it doing there? Maybe it's got a secret stash of bones. Who knows? But one thing's for sure, it's a dogman and it's got everyone wondering about its graveyard agenda. Aliens have been trending for a while now with numerous sightings here and there, but it seems a majority of humans don't want to accept that they're real. Nor are they denying it. Let's take a look at this possible alien sighting. You can see this strange creature with ears like an elephant and an emaciated looking body. It looks to be walking on its two legs, and as it raises its head, you can see a pair of hollow circles, I guess, are its eyes. And oh, it even has a trunk-like nose like an elephant. There is no way this is fake. Let us know in the comments if you believe aliens are real, and if you think this is one of them. Hold on to your hats, folks, because we've got a trail cam snapshot that's puzzling. Feast your eyes on this creature, a dog-like being with facial features that are, dare I say it, almost human-esque. I mean, just take a look at those eyes, nose, and mouth, eerily reminiscent of us humans. But let's not skip over the paws. They seem like a peculiar blend of human and animal. Now I'm not one to jump to conclusion, but this has got us wondering. Is this a lab-made hybrid, a long-lost species, or just a trick of the camera? What are your thoughts on this mysterious woodland wanderer? Share your theories in the comment section. All right, folks, it's time to rethink our perceptions of Bigfoot. We got some footage that throws the friendly, harmless stereotype right out of the window. Take a look at this footage. Someone spotted a Bigfoot in the woods aggressively throwing around tree branches and smashing down trees. Another clip here shows a Bigfoot chasing a man with so much hostility that this doesn't look like a creature that wants to shake your hands or take a selfie with you. In this one, we can hear a warning cry from a Bigfoot hiding among the trees. So the next time you find yourself face to face with a Bigfoot, maybe keep that selfie stick in check and approach with caution. They might not be as friendly as we once thought.
We've got a mystery on our hands, folks. Take a look at this bizarre living organism that's got the internet buzzing. It looks like jelly with these tiny strings that seem to move about and attach themselves to objects. Now, the big question is, what in the world is this thing? Now, I've seen my fair share of strange things on this channel, but this? This looks like the kind of stuff you'd find in a sci-fi movie right before all hell breaks loose. I mean, is this a harbinger of a zombie apocalypse, or maybe it's Mother Nature showing off her avant-garde side? The comment section is open to your wildest theories. What do you think this mysterious jelly-like organism is? And should we be stocking up on canned goods just in case? Share your thoughts. So someone sent in this next clip stating that they'd found a spot on the Earth where gravity didn't work. Yeah, you heard that right. Anti-gravity. Take a look. You can't imagine my excitement when I first heard the news. I thought, great, more alien stuff. But after watching it for a while, I don't think it is. I mean, I'm not a scientist, but I'm pretty sure that that's just the wind that pulled that stick up. And that shouldn't be too surprising because it looks like they're high up. <laughs> but what do I know? Next, we have another UFO sighting. Take a look. Doesn't that look like a scene from an alien movie? I know we have advanced over the years, but I doubt even our most sophisticated drones look like that. Despite not being high definition, we can certainly see that the footage there certainly has alien crafts. I believe we've gotten to the point where we shouldn't be asking if there are aliens amongst us. Instead, the appropriate question should be, how many of them are there, don't you think? What do you do when you stumble into a murder scene? What if the murder scene is this? Oh, did you think I meant a crime scene? No, no, no. I meant a group of crows. You know they're called a murder, right? Now that we're done with the wordplay, you have to wonder what's going on here. Why are there so many crows in that place? Our team wondered if something had happened at this Walmart and decided to comb the internet, but we found nothing. We wanted to believe something ominous was going on here. But taking a second look, we think there might be a logical reason or explanation. The problem is we don't have that explanation. Can any of you help, or have you perhaps come across the story before? If you have or can explain, please leave a message in the comments section as we'll be reading. Speaking of the bizarre and weird, take a look at this next footage. What do you see? A bunch of light moving around in the water, right? Take a look again. It looks like the lights are alive, doesn't it? Well, according to the one who recorded the footage, that's exactly what was happening. Yes, we do have some luminous creatures on this planet, but the last time we checked, those lived deep in the sea and didn't look remotely like this. It's for this reason that the one who recorded the footage believes we may be dealing with an alien. Quite frankly, I don't fault her for thinking so, but if it's an alien, why the water? Was it merely hiding in the water to not get detected, or are aliens aquatic beings? Think about it and share your thoughts in the comment section. Elephants have always been described as gentle giants, but this next footage may make you reconsider that statement. Enjoy! Now, the footage starts off introducing us to the ginormous and majestic elephant. After a few seconds, we realize that the elephant is up to something. But what? It's hard to say, but if you are any bit as mischievous as my assistant or have someone like him in your life, then you'll clearly know that it's about to do something mischievous, aka knock down the fence. 
Surely enough, it does. If you paid attention to the footage, though, you'd realize it did this very cautiously, as though it wanted to be gentle. Initially, I thought, oh, well, that's very cute. After seeing that creature be gentle even when it was causing trouble. After reading the comments, though, I realized that it was only checking and making sure that there was no electricity running through the wires. Smart little, uh, I mean, a giant bugger. Before you watch the next clip, could you please hit the like button, subscribe, and even drop a comment if you haven't already. It goes a long way to make it possible to create more videos for you. Thank you for doing so. Moving back to the day's episode. If you love weird sounds, this next one is for you. Listen. What do you think is making those sounds? I had my money on it being a bear or something along those lines. According to the one who sent in the footage though, it's far from that. He believes it's a Bigfoot. We've had a lot of audio on the channel claiming to be recordings of Bigfoot. The challenge with them is that each sound is different, making it difficult to find a believable pattern between them. So instead of making a declaration on this one, I'd like you to tell me what you think. Are these sounds from a Bigfoot or something else? Share your thoughts in the comment section. Did you see that? What did it look like? Some sort of giant paranormal creature, right? Well, that's what I saw. I'm not gonna lie, it had me very excited in the beginning. However, after scrutinizing the footage, we realized it was fake. Why would you do this? I mean, why would anyone do this and play with our feelings? Does our belief in the paranormal seem like a joke to you people? Get a hold of yourself. Phew, sorry for that mini breakdown. Please stop messing with footage and passing them off as the real deal. You stress some of us. My verdict on this footage, it's a fake. What do you think? Speaking of fakes, what are your thoughts on this footage? Somehow, some way, that creature has the body of a horse and a donkey. I googled for creatures that might look like this, but try as I did, I found nothing, and that's left me wondering if this is real or if it's fake. Take a look at it again. If this is a creature you recognize, then by all means, please do educate us in the comments section. But if it is not something you also recognize or know too, then my final verdict is that's not real, and that means this footage is some impressive CGI action, don't you think? Still on things we have a hard time determining to be real or fake, we have this. What do you think? Between this one and the previous one, which looks real and which does not? If you asked me, I would say this is a tad believable. Not just because we see humans in it, but also due to the fact that the clouds look a bit more realistic. I don't know if you guys can see it, but these clouds look like they're concealing a saucer or an alien spaceship. Do you see it? The question now is, is it real? I believe it is, but Stephen, my assistant, says otherwise. Which do you think it is? That's a Bigfoot, right? This footage was sent in by one of you whose trail cam captured this. He's uploaded this online before and told everyone that his camera had captured Bigfoot. Some agreed, while some thought it was nothing more than a hoax, either CGI or a man in a costume. He swears it's not CGI, but also wanted us to confirm if it's a man in a costume, so he stops talking about it. He personally believes it's Bigfoot or a cousin of the cryptid at least, but before I share my thoughts, what do you think this is? Go write your answer in the comments section and start with guess. Now that you have, my verdict is that this is a real Bigfoot. Some members of my team disagreed, but I was the one doing the narration, so I won. 
either way, or rather on a more serious note, I'd love to hear what you guys think. Please share your thoughts in the comments section. Before I share the next footage, allow me to ask, what do you think of ancient mythology? Personally, I love them, but just can't seem to think it's real, even though there are some who believe it's real. This footage you are seeing challenges my assertion, though. If you haven't already guessed what you are looking at, it's believed to be a petrified cyclops. For those unfamiliar with the term cyclops, in Greek mythology they are often depicted as the sons of Uranus, Sky, and Gaia, Earth. Now, I don't want to get into the complexities of mythology, but you have to admit, that sounds a bit ridiculous, yet very cool. Perhaps we delve into mythology another time if you guys show interest. Either way, if you look at what's on your screen, it seems like that's a cyclops, but is it real? Maybe. If it's real, how did it become petrified, et al? That's a question I won't be able to answer, but if all mythology is to be believed, perhaps Medusa could answer us. On that note, if you still haven't liked, commented, or subscribed to the channel yet, please do so now before I send that creature after you. On a more serious note, it really helps us out a ton and gives us the opportunity to make these videos for you. So please do so and share this video with your friends and family. Thank you very much. If you have lived a few decades, I'm sure you're conversant with and aware of the sleep paralysis demon. But what happens when you spot an invisible being moving through your bed? In fact, take a look at this footage. You see it, don't you? There's an invisible but very tangible force moving through the bed sheets. When the man attempts to grab it, however, it disappears like it was never there. If he didn't record it on camera, he may never have been believed. Notwithstanding, we still have questions that need answers. What is that thing? If we can even call it that. Where did it come from and how did it suddenly disappear when the man tried to grab it? Could it be the physical form of the sleep paralysis demon or is it something else entirely? It's hard to say, but you know what's not hard? Sharing your thoughts. Please do that in the comments section. We'll be reading. When was the last time you came across a tall humanoid with a white face that stared at and followed your every movement in the woods? If your answer isn't never, then you need to send an email to classifiedcaptures at gmail.com telling us about your experience. Either way, watch this. This footage was recorded by a man who was out there exploring the woods. Once he started enjoying the scenery too much, he decided it was best to record and document everything. It was this decision that led him to the creature you see on your screen. If you can't see it, pay attention to the center of the footage. You'll see a whitish face that appears to be blinking every few seconds. Now, he states that he's not seen anything like this before, and I believe him. The challenge now is that we too haven't seen anything like it, which makes it hard to identify. If it wasn't for the fact that this was captured in what appears to be a tropical area, I would have said it was a yeti. You and I, however, know those ones live only in snowy areas. That leaves us with one question. What in the name of cryptid is that? Since we're talking about feral cryptids, I thought I'd ship this one in too. Take a look. At first glance, you might think that's a wolf, but look again. Do you see the other features that make it look like a cryptid? I mean, you don't need to be a scientist to tell this isn't your everyday wolf. But if it isn't, then what is it? Well, my money is on it being a werewolf or a dogman. If you look critically at the image, you'll see it too. The facial expressions, its limbs, and generally how it's looking at the camera. But that could just be me. What do you also think? Repeat after me. You could never have enough Bigfoot footage. Now that we've cleared that out the way, watch this clip.
This footage you're seeing was captured by a hiker who was deep in the woods. Now, if you pay attention, you'll notice a tall, furry fellow seemingly taking a stroll through the forest. It has one of the most unique strides I've ever seen, and the one filming believes it's a Bigfoot. Is it, though? I'm tempted to say no, because its movements match that of someone in a heavy costume. But that could just be me. There are many others in the paranormal community who believe that this is definitely a Bigfoot. Personally, I just don't see it, but I'd want to know your thoughts as well. This footage starts off weird, with a little boy pointing in the direction of what appears to be a humanoid cryptid. The footage isn't clear, so it's hard to say what we're dealing with. A part of me screamed Bigfoot, but that thing is a face more that's much wider than what's associated with Bigfoot. This makes me think it might be another type of cryptid, either a variation of the Dogman or Werewolf cryptids or something else entirely. What do you think? This next footage, however, is one that is not so uncertain. Take a look. That's a Bigfoot, correct? Despite being far from the camera, we can tell. The body structure, the fur, the color, and the quality that makes them watch humans from afar are very present in this footage. This too was recorded by an explorer of the woods, and he believed he'd captured Bigfoot. I agree, this is a Bigfoot, but if you look critically, you'll realize it's on the smaller side of sizes. Does this invalidate the claim it's a Bigfoot? No, not at all. It could be a juvenile, which is what my team and I think. But what about you? And for our penultimate video, we thought we'd give you a bit of a scare. Take a look. <laughs> did that scare you? If it didn't, write, it didn't in the comment section. If it didn't, I may have to up my game, but let's zoom back to the footage. What do you think is going on here? I see a big spider and tiny ones. Is this spider actually mothering them, or did we stumble into a crime scene? Share your thoughts with us. Picture this, you're settling into your car, keys in hand, ready to kick off your day. Suddenly, your attention is drawn to a peculiar sight squirming its way out of an air conditioning vent. Now stop imagining. Take a look. A quick-witted car owner caught this bizarre moment on camera. A creature with claws and a curious pinkage appendage emerging through the vents. Say hello to the star-nosed mole, aka the mysterious and freakish-looking visitor. Its distinctive features can offset even the most ironclad of stomachs. If its visit to the man's car serves any purpose, it's a reminder that even in the mundane spaces of our daily lives, nature can surprise us with its unique and unexpected inhabitants. Who knew your car's AC system could become an entrance for the denizens of the underground world? Now, we know that by seeing this footage, you're already confused and wondering what that is. Would you believe me if I told you that the uploader of the footage believes it's human? According to the uploader, this is a 30-centimeter human being that was discovered in the city of Ilam, Kurdistan in Iran. Now, the original post was in Arabic, and we tried our best to get translations of it, yet there was not much we could gather other than the fact that we were looking at a 30-centimeter human being. While information and news about occurrences happening inside Iran are scarce, I doubt a discovery like this could be kept under wraps if it was true. But then again, those are just my thoughts. What are yours? Please share in the comment section. Here we have an Instagram user who embarked on a late-night adventure into the woods, and what they stumbled upon is truly perplexing. As they ventured further into the forest, their camera captured an astonishing sight. Peeking from behind a tree was a mysterious creature, its intent seemingly fixed on the adventurer. 
Yet as soon as it became apparent that it had been detected, the creature swiftly withdrew and retreated into the woods. Now, the individual who filmed this bizarre encounter strongly believes it to be none other than the elusive Bigfoot. But there's always room for speculation in situations like this. Was it indeed a genuine sighting of the legendary cryptid, or might there be a more earthly explanation for this mysterious creature? We'll let you decide. This picture was taken by a backpacker, and let me provide you with a little backstory on what you are seeing here. A girl and her friend had gone backpacking on a trail in the mountains. As night fell, they grew tired and decided to camp on the side of the trail. After setting up their tents, they went to sleep. However, in the early morning around 5 a.m., the girls were abruptly awakened by footsteps signaling the presence of an intruder. One of the girls felt the footsteps stop right in front of their tent, prompting her to unzip and confront the intruder. To their surprise, it was a man who appeared disorientated. When asked about his intentions, he mumbled that he was looking for his friends. The girl sternly told him off and retreated into her tent, hoping the strange man would leave. When the girls woke up the next morning, they saw the man sleeping on the ground beside their tent, having spent the night in the open. The girl then captured a picture of him. The man woke up, took his backpack and left. Weird, don't you think? Could it have been a homeless man? Is someone trying to hurt them or a spirit of the forest? A woman is chilling at home with her dog, thinking everything is normal when suddenly she hears some strange noises coming from one of the rooms. Now, being the brave soul she is, she decides to investigate. Little did she know, her whole reality was about to somersault. As she cautiously makes her way to the source of the noise, she's probably expecting a raccoon or maybe a mischievous cat. But oh no, it's way weirder than that. She finds her dog not on all fours like usual, but standing upright on two feet. And that's not even the jaw-dropping part. The two-legged dog has figured out how to operate doors. Yeah, you heard that right. It opens the door like it's just another Tuesday afternoon, and when it spots the human, it swiftly shuts the door as if to say, nothing to see here, move along. Now the woman is left there screaming at the closed door, a jaw probably somewhere near the floor and wondering, was that my dog? She's convinced it's a skinwalker. I mean, come on, how does a regular dog master doorknob turning and door shutting? It's like your everyday pet crossed into the twilight zone. Unless you can prove that your dog does similar, I may have to go with her hypothesis. On that note, if you still haven't liked, commented, or subscribed to the channel yet, please do so now before I send that creature after you. On a more serious note, it really helps out a ton and gives us the opportunity to keep making these videos for you. So please do so and share this video with your friends and family. Thank you very much. Three women with distinct appearances venture into a remote area shrouded in tall grass and enveloped by nature's embrace. The first two women sport short hair, while the third woman stands out with a long, flowing black hair that cascades gracefully down her back. Their enthusiasm and purposeful movements have given rise to speculative whispers, hinting at the possibility of them being witches, especially the woman with the long hair, who some describe as bewitching. The long dresses they wear, while traditional, don't necessarily align with this stereotypical image of witches. After all, people often dress in different ways for various reasons, and clothing alone isn't a definitive indicator of one's nature or intentions. But what do you think? Could they really be witches, or is it something else entirely? Kindly share your thoughts. This next footage features a quiet night in the Swiss woodlands and a lone man braving the darkness. Suddenly, eerie screams pierce the tranquil air, resembling the haunting cries of children. The unsettling sounds send shivers down his spine and a wave of fear washes over him. Faced with this chilling scenario, the man, too terrified to investigate further, retreats to the safety of his home. 
Now here's the question. What would you have done in such a spine-tingling situation? Would you have summoned the courage to venture deeper into the mysterious forest, or would the instinct for self-preservation have guided you back to the comforting glow of your home? Above all, what do you think he stumbled into? Child abduction, or did he encounter spirits or malevolent beings like skinwalkers who were just trying to take advantage? Share your thoughts with me in the comment section. Before you watch the next clip, could you please hit the like button, subscribe, and even drop a comment if you haven't already? It goes a long way to make it possible to create more videos for you. Thank you for doing so. Moving back to the day's episode. Ah, The Matrix is a movie that not only captivated audiences with its mind-bending narrative, but also left us questioning the very fabric of reality. And now, here we are in the real world, pondering whether we might be living in a coded existence. So check this out. A man at a train station doing a perplexing dance of falling and getting up, falling and getting up. Now that alone might raise an eyebrow, but what takes it to the next level is that this guy is not just tripping randomly. No, sir. He's falling at the same spot in the same way with the same reaction every single time. Now, before you start thinking he's just practicing some avant-garde dance routine, the theorists are throwing around a different idea. They're suggesting that this man's seemingly repetitive actions are no ordinary clumsiness. Instead, they're labeling it as a glitch in the matrix. It's like reality is stuck on a loop and he's unwittingly become the star of this glitchy show. What do you think, though? A true glitch in the matrix or simply a man who may be on drugs? In the depths of the unknown, a group of curious campers embarked on an adventure undeterred by the mysterious noises that echoed through the dark. As they ventured further into the mysterious wilderness, they were confronted by an otherworldly creature, a black entity that appeared to be a bizarre fusion of a wolf and a bear. This peculiar beast emitted strange sounds, its buccal cavity revealing a multitude of razor-sharp teeth hinting at its predatory nature. What set this creature apart from the ordinary was its uncanny ability to shift between being on all fours and standing upright on its two hind legs, reminiscent of a human. But it was the most unsettling detail that puzzled the campers. The creature had no discernible eyes, leaving one to wonder how it navigated in the darkness. The campers may have survived this encounter, but the questions left in its wake may continue to haunt them and us. What do you think that was? Is it truly a paranormal being, or are we dealing with an actual wildlife creature no one knows about? Share your thoughts with us in the comments section. So picture this, I'm chilling at the park, just soaking in the vibes, right? Then out of the blue, I see something weird happening across the street. I grab my phone and start recording, and you won't believe what I caught. That's the story of the man who recorded the footage you're seeing. If you pay attention, you'll see that there's this ghostly figure decked out in a robe, casually strolling down the street like it's the most normal thing in the world. The eerie part? It's like it's taking the most cautious steps ever, making the whole thing even spookier. I'm telling you, the vibe went from chill park day to a full-on ghost hunt. The figure, draped in that mysterious robe, turned the street into something straight out of a supernatural flick. And yeah, those deliberate slow steps tell me you've seen something creepier. Now I'm left here wondering, what's the deal with this ghostly character? Is it on some ancient quest, or did it just take a wrong turn in the afterlife? It's a wild mystery that's got my brain buzzing. Imagine checking your trail camera, expecting the usual wildlife snapshots, only to be met with a mysterious creature that defies explanation. This photo reveals a towering figure standing at least seven feet tall, draped in dark fur and unmistakably humanoid. The creature's face, a curious blend of ape-like features with a human nose, raises eyebrows and stirs the imagination. 
Is it possible this is a genuine encounter with the elusive Sasquatch, or is there room for skepticism, with some suggesting a potential hoax involving a person in an elaborate costume? Personally, I'm tempted to believe it could be a hoax unless there's some explanation for how the creature's fur looks like it just walked out of the dry cleaners when it actually lives in a place that leaves fur dirty and matted. Perhaps this is just me being difficult, but what do you think? A hiker was capturing the beauty of his surroundings on camera, enjoying the peaceful silence that surrounds him, when out of the blue, a creature emerges from the shadows. At first, he's startled, but soon that surprise and shock becomes nothing more than fear. It was the majestic mountain lion, its piercing gaze is filled with curiosity. The camera keeps rolling, capturing a breathtaking encounter. You'd think after being discovered, the mountain lion would leave, but no, it didn't. Instead, it attacked and tried to get the upper hand over the man. Thankfully, though, the man in question knew who and what he was dealing with. He started making loud noises and making himself big, which scared the animal off. If you were ever in a pinch with a mountain lion, you should do the same. Turning your back and running may just be the last thing that you do. Do skinwalkers commonly take the forms of dogs? What would you do if you entered your compound and found a dog in your home, especially when no one owns one? You'd freak out, right? That's exactly what happened to the individual in this capture you're seeing. Now, this isn't why we are starting today's episode with this very one. Our reason involves a skinwalker. Would you believe me if I told you that skinwalkers are rumored to take the forms of dogs? In the place where this image was taken, skinwalkers are common according to the natives, and they like to take the form of dogs since everyone owns one or at least feeds a stray. Taking this form is safer for them as no one would suspect a thing. There are times, however, when they want you to know they're skinwalkers, probably to threaten you. The uploader of the footage believes this is one such time, which is why she never entered the apartment until help came. Once help came, they entered the apartment and found nothing. At least, that's how the story goes. What do you think? Here's a spooky tale for you. Two friends having a chill night on the beach when things take a mysterious turn. So there they are, just soaking in the tranquility of the night, maybe unwinding from the day's stress when something caught their attention. It was enough to make them both snap around and, without a second thought, bolt away in sheer terror. What caused this panic? A strange, pale creature emerged from the darkness, quietly making its way toward them. This humanoid figure had long, eerily crooked legs and arms that dangled oddly. Picture something straight out of a horror movie right there on the beach with them. No hesitation, those poor guys hit the panic button and zoomed out of there as their lives depended on it. Watching this clip, I can't blame them. Can you? In the heart of an unknown area, a group of fearless men who appeared to be animal control experts stumbled upon a striking sight, a magnificent white bear. This impressive creature was making its way along the muddy trail. At first glance, the bear seemed harmless, a testament to the breathtaking beauty of its natural surroundings. However, nature can be unpredictable, and the tranquility was shattered when the bear, driven by instincts and perhaps feeling threatened, made a sudden lunge toward the men. What happened next was a testament to the courage and composure of the humans. One of the men stood his ground, his voice firm and resolute as he challenged the bear with a stern warning. You get. This brave confrontation caused the bear to rethink its decision, and with a reluctant retreat, it returned to the mud-covered path. This is a striking example of the unpredictable nature of wild animals. While this bear appeared cute and endearing at first, it quickly became wild and dangerous within a matter of seconds.
Next, we have another cave expedition with a mysterious twist. Let's dive into the intrigue. Venturing into the depths of a cave can lead to unexpected encounters, and this footage shared by a group of explorers proves just that. In the shadows of the cavern, a peculiar being emerges, a figure draped in dark robes with a ghostly pale face. The tension in the air is palpable as the men in the footage react with a mix of fear and fascination, their whispers and shushing underscoring the eerie ambience. <laughs> Now one can't help but wonder, is this yet another encounter with a djinn? What's your take on this encounter? Could it be a guardian spirit, a trick of shadows, or something beyond the realms of our understanding? Share your thoughts. During a heavy flood in Peru, a reporter was climbing stairs while filming when his camera captured something intriguing. It appears that the reporter may not have even noticed that she'd caught something on camera as she continued talking while the camera briefly focused on the mysterious figure. The creature in question appears humanoid with dark skin crawling on the stairs and following the woman. According to the residents of the area, they believe this creature resides in the waters and has been washed up on land during the flood. While many are excited about the prospects of this being nothing but a paranormal being, some were quick to point out that it might simply be a man who was on the verge of succumbing to hypothermia. Take a close look at the footage. Which do you think it is? While scouting through the woods, a hunter stumbled upon a captivating sight. Concealed amidst the underbrush, he spotted what he firmly believed to be a Bigfoot. The cryptid sat there, seemingly absorbed in its own activities, blissfully unaware of the hunter's presence. Such encounters with elusive creatures like Bigfoot continue to fuel speculation and curiosity. It's a tantalizing glimpse into a world of mysteries lurking in the wilderness. Two adventurous individuals were deep in the woods when their attention was captivated by an enigmatic sight among the trees. Behind that tree there, do you see it? There, oh, look! Fire. We're moving! Fire. Fire. Now, what was that? It was a towering creature notably resembling a massive primate traversing the terrain on two legs. The creature took measured strides amidst the trees, seemingly oblivious to the presence of the two observers who were diligently filming this extraordinary encounter. Based on the available evidence, this sighting strongly suggests the presence of a Bigfoot, a legendary and elusive cryptid believed to roam remote wilderness areas. The observer's reactions appears to be a blend of amazement and fascination at this rare and remarkable glimpse of an iconic cryptid. Behind that tree there, do you see it? There, look! Fire! We're moving! Fire! Yeah, now, what was that? Now let me introduce you to a creature that seems straight out of a fairy tale, the screaming, hairy armadillo. Yeah, you heard it right, and no, it's not a creature of fiction, but a real living being. These peculiar beings are known for their vocalizations that can only be described as screaming. Imagine a hairy armadillo whose defense mechanism is being too annoying to eat. It screams till whatever is trying to eat it just loses interest or is startled. That's the creature on your screen. A trail cam owner in Washington uploaded his footage when he saw what he had captured. In this footage, we can see a dense forest in the midst of the night, but a few moments later, something walks by among the trees. It was a huge being taking strong strides on its two legs. The creature is covered in dark fur, so it blends perfectly with the night. However, you can make out its outline, which resembles a Bigfoot. Is it really one, or is something else entirely? We'll update you as soon as we can confirm. I 
In the dead of night, a group of motorcyclists in India stumble upon an enigmatic figure ambling along the road. The being in question bore an uncanny resemblance to a hairless, naked human, yet its movements were far from ordinary, characterized by a peculiar, almost sluggish gait. The sight was undeniably eerie and sparked fervent debates among those who witnessed it. Was this a chance encounter with another form of extraterrestrial life, or could there be more terrestrial explanations for this strange, slow-moving entity? Perhaps you can shed some light on this unsolved mystery. In this unsettling security footage captured at a home, two individuals were enjoying a late night swim in their pool when an unexpected guest crashed their aquatic gathering. Out of nowhere, a crocodile stealthily slithered into the pool, plunging the night into chaos. As the commotion began, the man in the pool displayed quick reflexes, managing to escape the water and evade the clutches of the lurking reptile. However, the situation took a more perilous turn for the woman, who found herself in a heart-pounding struggle with the crocodile. In a tense and terrifying moment, it appeared as though the crocodile was about to strike. Thankfully, she eventually managed to extricate herself from the dangerous encounter. The sudden and unexplicable appearance of this predator raises many questions about why and how it found its way into a residential pool. Here's a fascinating discovery shared by a Reddit user. Two adventurous souls deep into exploring a collapsed cave stumbled upon a mysterious pile of rocks. With curiosity as their guide, they decided to unveil the secrets hidden beneath. As the rocks shifted, an unexpected sight met their eyes, a strange face peering back at them from the darkness, only to retreat into the shadows. The men, now with their lights illuminating the unknown, captured the entire encounter on film. The intriguing part? In the heart of the moment, one of them can be heard shouting jinn, an Arabic term often associated with demons or evil spirits. But let's think about something here. If that's a jinn, a demonic spirit with power and all the kinds of things we've heard, how is it trapped in the ground? Still on things that look like dogs but are not, take a look at this next footage. What do you see? All who saw it initially believed we were dealing with an abnormally large dog, but it turns out it's nothing more than a pig. Has anyone seen a pig like this before? Can you tell or guess its exact species? If you can, please leave it in the comments section for us. We've got something special for the best response. Our next eerie clip was posted by a YouTuber, Shay, who is known for his explorations of unusual and often paranormal places. During one of his expeditions, Shay ventured into an abandoned, waterlogged shelter with stairs. While going down the stairs and recording the journey, the camera captured something that initially went unnoticed, but sent shivers down the spines of those who later spotted it. Hidden in a small compartment at the side of the stairs was a figure. This space was far too confined to accommodate a person, and the entity concealed within it was not immediately obvious unless you were actively searching for it, which is precisely what Shay's subscriber did. Upon closer examination of the slowed down footage, the mysterious presence becomes apparent, a head of hair and a disfigured pale face. Speculation arises that this could be the ghost of one of the shelter's former residents, or perhaps something even more enigmatic.
In an eerie turn of events, a couple woke up one morning to find their bedroom window had been left open despite being certain they'd closed it the night before. Intrigued and slightly unnerved, they decided to unravel this mystery by setting up a camera to monitor the window while they slept. The following morning, when they reviewed the footage, what they discovered sent chills down their spine. There, captured on video, was a massive dark figure lurking just outside their window. This figure possessed inhuman glowing eyes, exuding an eerie and unsettling presence. What's particularly unsettling is that their home appeared to be close to the woods, suggesting that this creature could be anything at all. While the couple's course of action after the incident remains unknown, one can't help but think that it might be a sign for them to consider a change of residence. Wouldn't you agree? In the mysterious waters of the Missouri River, a captivating piece of footage was captured, hinting at the presence of a large and enigmatic creature. While we can easily rule out the typical suspects like crocodiles or alligators, what lurks beneath these waves seems to be something altogether bigger and more elusive, a water monster of sorts. The immense waves generated by this concealed creature suggest not only its size but also its remarkable length. As we ponder this enigma, we can't help but wonder about the identity of this hidden river dweller. Could it be an undiscovered species or an ancient aquatic giant that's managed to elude our understanding? This encounter certainly sounds like something straight out of a cryptozoology or paranormal thriller. Okay, so it's something. A dog or what? A group of people standing by the lake spot a creature on the opposite shore. At first glance, everyone agrees that it resembles a dog, which is peculiar in itself. Oh, la verga! <laughs> However, the shocker comes when, after a few moments, the creature does something wholly unexpected. It stands up on its hind legs. This sudden transformation from a four-legged animal to a bipedal figure is enough to leave anyone dumbfounded. But as with all cryptid sightings, there's room for skepticism and further investigation. Was this truly a face-to-face -face encounter with the elusive dogman, or could there be a more rational explanation for this perplexing event? Tell us what you think in the comment section. The classic someone's watching me in the woods scenario. This time, it's a lone explorer taking a stroll through the wilderness who gets that hair-raising sensation that they are not alone. Trusting their instincts, they reach for their camera, focus, and there it is. Behind the thick bushes, a creature lurking, concealing itself behind a tree. This cryptid shares the classic features often associated with the legendary Bigfoot, dark fur, and the ability to stand on two legs. It's definitely a scary moment when you realize you might be in the presence of one of the most iconic cryptids of them all, don't you think? Imagine the delightful world of rabbits, those adorable creatures with their fluffy fur and unmistakably large ears. They're a bundle of cuteness that has found a special place in the hearts of many. However, what do you do when a rabbit is as big as a dog? I present to you the Flemish Giants. They are a type of rabbits that are bred for their meat. However, some individuals have chosen to keep these colossal bunnies as pets, and the decision is not without reason. And just like the small ones, these huge bunnies are just as cute. In this clip, we have another capture of what appears to be a Sasquatch, commonly known as Bigfoot sitting on the forest floor with its head down.
This creature seems to have brown hair, which is consistent with many descriptions of Bigfoot sightings. While it's crucial to approach such footage with a healthy dose of skepticism, the context here is intriguing. The area where this footage was captured is renowned for Bigfoot sightings and is not known for having a population of bears or primates. This raises questions about the possibility of it being a legitimate Bigfoot encounter. As exciting as that thought might be, without clearer evidence or more extensive documentation, it's challenging to draw definitive conclusions. With the evidence presented to you, however, what do you have to say about the whole thing? Still on the bizarre and strange, take a look at this clip. There it is. The footage starts off with a group of friends staring at an old, abandoned, and run-down house. After a few seconds, they look like they have seen something spooky and quickly drive off. Go, 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 go. This was sent to us from a fan on this page, stating he saw something otherworldly, a ghost, if you may. Naturally, that excited us, but after going through the footage, we couldn't make out what he was referring to. But perhaps you can. Take a second look at the footage and share with us what you see. We'd love to know. The idea of extraterrestrial life visiting Earth has been a topic of fascination and debate for years. Now in this intriguing footage, we have a piece of that mysterious puzzle. Picture this. A little girl innocently descending a staircase, all while being filmed by an unknown person. As she steps outside into the silent night, something catches the camera's attention. A strange creature lurking behind a tree. This being possessed pale skin and large, dark eyes resembling the classic description of an alien. Now the big question arises, could this be a genuine encounter with extraterrestrial entities, or is it perhaps a well-executed prank? Now what are we looking at here? A creature with the head of a fish, the upper torso of a human, and a fish tail. Just when we thought we'd seen it all, this hybrid creature emerges, resembling something concocted in a lab. The creature appears lifeless, its hand seemingly affixed to its back. Unfortunately, there isn't much information available on this creature, so we cannot definitely say if it's real or a fabrication. However, one thing is for sure, the prospect of sharing the same planet with a creature like this is something most would find unsettling. What would you do if you saw a strange creature in the woods? Well, if you answered run away, I wouldn't blame you because it's something I myself would have done. But the individual in the clip I'm about to share with you had different ideas. The clip starts with a weird figure standing in the distance, not moving. Seeing something standing like this in the middle of nowhere in the night is bound to send the heart racing and scared. But the one recording the footage simply gets closer to get a better view. The creature is definitely humanoid, yet not human. The recorder's curiosity gets the better of him and he pokes it with a stick. Despite the poke, it remains indifferent and maintains its weird, ominous vibe. A second look and you'll realize that the creature's body feels more like cloth than it does skin. Are we really looking at a cryptid, or is this an elaborate hoax? Share your thoughts in the comments section. Next, we have odd footage of a creature I believe you may recognize. Have a look. What do you reckon that is? 
While at first glance, you may think it's a gorilla because of its fur and muscles, but in a second, your mind might correct to remind you that gorillas don't walk upright. What about a chimpanzee? It could be a chimpanzee, right? After all, those ones walk upright, don't they? You might find that comforting, but then again, you are quickly reminded that chimpanzees aren't that tall or buff. What then could this 